Hey everybody, today I'm going to show you how to install these 3D printed slider clips in your sunroof. This should fix any tilting issues that you might have. So let's jump right in. To get this panel off, you just pull it down. Uh, all of my clips are broken, so it doesn't really matter. Then, you want to drop the sunroof on the top just a little bit. So when it's at its flat position, probably like a half a centimeter or so just down. As soon as it starts to drop, then we'll release this. You can then move this one back, get access to the bolts here and the bolts up here uh, to remove the whole sunroof and then get access to the rails. So let's do that. That's what the drop looks like. Literally, you know, just underneath that metal. Right there actually. Oops, yeah. yep, that's the one. Then you take it out. Take this slide, it'll make my life a bit easier, slightly. Okay, once you have the sunroof headliner back uh, and the sunroof is still tilted down, you haven't done anything, you remove these three nuts and then you're able to swivel the whole sunroof up and down, giving you access to those two torques and you can remove that. And to get the slider clips in, you will have to tilt the whole mechanism up, uh, but that shouldn't be an issue. Okay, let's get started. And we're doing that the wrong way even. And, see these ones? Position there, position there. Try and keep your positions and it will maintain your alignment at the top of the sunroof so you don't have to recalibrate. I did put sound editing on my sunroof. And the difference of it is astounding. It has done nothing. But it does look cool. Okay. Now, we're onto the torque bolts. That one over there. And that one over there. We're just gonna do that. Now you can see you have the world of access to get to it. That's tightening. We don't want to tighten. Lord have mercy. Um, just a tip, don't put 100% thread lock on it and don't lose it underneath your seat, which I have just done. Lord, please, if you're watching, give me, give me hope, Joanna. we can see where they broke these are my previously 3d printed ones I'm not burning well for you guys yeah so you do want to move it forward brand new 3D printed ones. Okay, so what you're just gonna do, same as factory ones. You can see on this new design, a lot more room here to play with uh, in terms of strength. Reconnect, pop. So now let's put these covers back on. Now, incredibly annoying task begins of putting this back.
Okay guys, I'll show you now an easy way to get the sunroof all back in place. So you'll notice that the pins sit on these little sliders that go back and forth uh, inside the rail and the metal brackets has two holes on the sunroof, one for the bolts, the first one to the left and all the way on the right, that's where the little metal pin needs to sit. What you wanna do is you wanna get that whole slider as far left as possible to the back of the sunroof. Okay, once the pin is touching the brackets, just use your finger and push it just behind the metal bracket of the actual sunroof panel. And then you just want to slide that whole slider assembly forward so that the pin is just riding on the back of that bracket. You want to move the pin forward, obviously, until it gets to that little location there where it's supposed to sit. Uh, and it might not pop into place, you know, instantly as it's by that location. It might be a little bit too high or a little bit too low. All you want to do is then just jiggle the sunroof, maybe up, down, give it a little whack, and that should just seat everything nicely. So you want to lift the sunroof a little bit with your hands because the back bolts aren't in yet and put the two front screws in. And I just want to kind of line this one up to the center. That one's also lined up roughly center. Got that spaced accordingly how it was originally. This one was around here. Actually this one is flat back like that. So, And you'll see just now where we'll stop. Keep going, keep going. Just there. Just as it's done that. So you can still push on the sunroof a little bit to give you that, that movement. And then here you can play with it. There you go.